السلام علیکم ویلکم ٹو مائی چینل کوڈ سٹی ان ٹو ڈیز ویڈیو وی آر گوئنگ ٹو سی دیٹ ہاؤ کین وی امپلیمنٹ پل ٹو ریفریش فیچر ان فلٹر بٹ بفور آئی اسٹارٹ آئی ووڈ لائک ٹو ٹیل یو دیٹ دس از مائی فیس بک گروپ سو اف یو ہیون جوائن دس گروپ یٹ دین پلیز جوائن دس یو کین فائنڈ دا لنک ان دا ڈسکرپشن اینڈ آلسو اف یو ہیون سبسکرائب مائی چینل یٹ دین پلیز سبسکرائب مائی چینل اینڈ ڈونٹ فار گیٹ ٹو پریس دا بیل آئیکن so let's start our topic so what does pull to refresh means if you see the big apps like facebook twitter instagram if you swipe uh, those applications down then it will refresh the ui with the new updated data so what does that mean uh, suppose you have a screen in which you get the data from the api and display on the screen as a list view So when that data is updated or the new data is inserted on the back end then it will take no effect unless you reload that screen to again call the api and get the latest data well to clarify this let me show you in the application so as you see that i created a simple application in which i have a uh, elevated button in the center of my screen so if i click this button then it will call the api that is locally created on my desktop machine so that api returns me the total number of records and the data of the players such as the name of the player and the team name of this player so now if i add more data to my api uh, let me add this data so now in my api response if i again call my api so you see now the total number of records is now 6 and two more players are added in my api but in my application it is still showing me the total number of records is 4 and these four players so to update the new data on to the screen what i have to do now is to again call my api to get the latest data and for that i have to go back to my main screen and then i have to click this button again then it will again call my api and then get the latest data from the api but this is very irritating for the end user because to see the updated data user have go back to the main screen then press this button then the application will call the api and then get the latest data from the api so for that the pull to refresh feature is introduced and to implement this feature flutter provides a widget called refresh indicator so let me show you that how can we achieve this uh, pull to refresh in flutter so get, go back to our pull to refresh dot dart file and we have to just wrap our this column widget into the refresh indicator widget and in this refresh indicator widget we have a property called on refresh which takes a function so we have to just pass our this api function in this property so now if i hot restart my application now I, if i click this button it will call the api and now if i drag my application down swipe my application down then you see this circular indicator now if i release my mouse click then the refresh indicator will call this on refresh property in which i have passed my get data function and in that get data function the api has been called and the new data has been returned from the api that will be display on to my screen so let me add more data to my api so now if i again call my api then as you see now the total number of record is 8 and two more players are added to my uh, api response and now in my application if i just uh, swipe my application down then my api method call again and now the new data will be updated to my screen 
so the total number of record is eight and these two more players are added to my list view so that is the way to implement pull to refresh feature in flutter so if you have any query related to this you can ask me in the comment section or you can join my facebook group and ask your query there so if you like my video then please share this video and don't forget to subscribe my channel thank you